Hello, hello. This is the Awful and Awesome Entertainment Wrap, episode three hundred and fourteen. This is Rajesh Sen, and this is Abhinandan Sekri. This week we have watched everything. It's one of those weeks. Shocking. You, I even watched and heard a Raftar song. And full. I did not want. This is not my idea to review a song called "Oh Shit" by Raftar. It was <laughs> her idea. Uh, so we have. रॉकी और रानी की प्रेम कहानी आई सॉ द ट्रेलर ऑफ रॉकी एंड रानी की प्रेम कहानी आई एम मिड सेंटेंस सो आई विल नॉट वॉच दैट फिल्म आई एक्चुअली सेड आई वोट वॉच इट बट राजश्री इंसिस्टेड एंड यू वॉज सो हैप्पी आफ्टर दैट से Then a documentary film called The Deepest Breath. Hmm. Uh, then the controversy around the Elephant Whisperer. We will tell you. I mean, we will discuss. This has happened in a few films. And It's always in a grey. Uh, then Kajol's statement on equal pay that was. Um, She was in a giving an uh, a talk hmm. at some uh, college thing at a college or something. Hmm. and uh, she said about um, it's very little so we'll say it now itself she said they must have asked her about equal pay so only that part of the clip is there and she says she does not see what everyone seeing on twitter that she said women are not going to get equal pay she said that the d films like uh, wonder woman are made like a woman mm. makes mm. a film which does as well as mm. a don or a patan she mm. said mm. we can not ask for equal pay you will get equal pay so but the way she framed it it's was she's justifying yeah. she, i mean she was an apologetic feminist yeah that way so she got so and before that she said something about uh, uneducated people governing us for which she had to then, then retract then that also but this she is not apologizing for yeah because this is not about modi ji na ha huh. because even that wasn't about modi ji Huh, but that? but the backlash Ajay Devgan said what if yeah. it is about some so you have to quickly retract and unfortunately this fear and cowardice extends to news media uh often it is general cowards uh, you know have inherited huge media empires uh, and part of it is because the revenue is um from comes government. from ads and much of it is government ads in fact today's paper i hmm. saw the first page was Bagel. Uh, I'd forget which paper. Huh. First page was Bagel, ad and full then, page. Huh. Second page was uh, uh, Modi ji full page ad. Lovely. Third page was Bhagwan Thman full page Lovely. ad. So basically, three governments, Congress, AAP, BJP have covered the cost of the paper. But some of you will be reading the paper thinking that this is going to serve us. It's public interest news. How sweet! <laughs> How sweet! <laughs> so cute! I'm. I love the faith. But uh, we don't do any of that shit. So you can go to newslawney. dot com, subscribe, and our Manipur stories have started coming out. I'm mm-hmm. sure you've seen a lot of them. There's many more that are yet to be published. Uh, Ridesh Joshi has travelled to the hills to bring you a series on the devastation that is caused because of climate change and how we have unregulated exploitation of the hills, and that has led to the kind of climate disasters that is yet not. topped up so i would appreciate if you can subscribe top up the nl sena the link is in the show notes below or you can go to newslaw.com and it's self explanatory what you can do to support journalism because by supporting journalism you're actually supporting yourself or you can let everyone run by the uh, you know money from uh, adani ambani patanjali uh, and all the government i would just like to say that i did not want to watch rocky or rani ki prem kahani You on some Punjabi Bengali connection that you thought that since I'm Punjabi or Bengali, we'll half both appreciate Punjabi. it. I'm half Punjabi, so I will say that you kind of liked it. It see my expectations of Karan Johar films are very low, so I thought it was as bad or good as that's my whole point with this film that everyone's carrying on saying it's so progressive, it's so progressive, it's so different from it. It's not. It's a Karan Johar film. There's nothing progressive or different from his other films. What was that? That film was very bad. A Dil Hai Mushkil was the worst I felt of his films. But otherwise, not all his films are like this only. So it was as good or bad as the others. I thought it would be bad, but I must admit, it wasn't bad. It was fucking terrible. <laughs> So oh yet God, again, you built up for the new to the joke. Rajshri Sen has <laughs> wasted four hours of my life. Three hours it was, Nico. 
fucking I went to the wrong cinema. Oh, that you only said to buy in Sangam. Doesn't matter. Arre, I went to the fucking wrong cinema. You went to Vasant Kun to watch a shit film. The guy saw the ticket because it wasn't flashing. Then he looks at me, says, "Yeah, galat cinema mein hai," because she sends the ticket five minutes before the. Anyway, I don't know whether it's as good or bad as a Karan Johar film, but I'm surprised a fifty-year-old man has made this film. <laughs> I'm shocked that the first film that he made, whatever kuch kuch hota hai. I mean, in a human being, there's growth in twenty years. Any kind of growth, like as a filmmaker, your aesthetics, your context, depth, anything. There is fucking zero growth. Nothing. It is like, it's like regressing. It is such a shit film. I cannot even tell you. Okay, but there are two, three nice things. There were two, three nice things. What are the two, three nice things? Eh? So I'll say the nice things first. There's a sequence of the uh, father. We should also Tota. Say who they are, so they are Bengali stars, no? Yeah. Tala. So Chunni Ganguly, who is a two-time national award winner, mm-hmm. and she does Bengali cinema. art cinema. Okay. Though. And she is an Emmy in English and all that. And Tota <laughs> is a- a- that's also important. Mm-hmm. We are not uneducated mm-hmm. like that. Tota Roy Choudhary now is mainly a TV. And no, he does films also. But he was in Feluda, which is that you know Feluda, Satyajit Three is Feluda, the detective. Felu. Felu, he's your pal. What is this? Your nickname for him? No, as in isn't like sort of the everyone's dog. No, da. please keep quiet. Don't you're doing. Oh, as in Feluda. Feluda, Feluda. <laughs> It's like Feluda. So. So does he have mm. a a very sweet female accomplice called Kulfi? Because no, then it would be that only in a current Johar film that would Feluda, happen. Huh. So, um, Ranveer's father is played by Amir Bashir. His mother is played by Shiti Jog, and his uh, sister is played by Anjali, Anjali Anand. Anand, who is an overweight girl who they call Golu. And he he has a grandfather who is Dharmendra. Dharmendra that is, is a very big role, <laughs> which is shocking. So, Varun Dhawan is also in the cameo the song. Oh, then I missed that part. So first, missed thank God, that. I missed those first two minutes of that song. So the good thing about this film is one sequence, which in the promo I hated, was so ghastly. With this, it's basically an ode to Dola Re Dola from yeah. Devdas, but it is um, Tota Ranveer Roy Choudhury and Tota are dancing to uh, this song and, and uh, doing we, Kathak. I don't know if it's Kathak, but anyway. Uh, <laughs> Tota is as convincing as a Kathak dancer as Salman was, Khan was as Dancing. a as as a uh, classical singer. As Ham Dil Dil. Because he is Bengali, I say. His movements it. are hardly professional. I mean, a professional Kathak dancer, it's it's like. But Tota has never danced. They made him dance in this film. Such a big number yeah, they've so given. Even, That's not even fair. Even Salman also, is na? not a classical singer, but they made him a classical singer. Ham Dil Dil Dil. Because some which does not. Anyway, so. I thought Tota was so very interesting. Other than Alia, who acts well, as does this boy, Ranveer. Ranveer. This film has some laugh out loud moments because the lines, which are predictable lines, but they're still you know, like a banta santa joke. You know it, but you laugh. Other than that, also the their s- house is also odd, na? No? Yeah, the set Ranveer's design is house. ridiculous. Kashmir ki NGO. So they they said that okay, <laughs> she has to do a show. What should she do on Kashmir? And it should be NGO. So let's do Kashmir ki NGO. Like what the fuck? Like fuck the, <laughs> the illiterates who have written this film don't even get me started. Uh, then everything is color coordinated. Everything like, like it's like. Did you notice that when she was wearing a yellow sari and Dharmendra comes out, he's wearing a yellow scarf. Every basically. But that's a Karan Johar. I film. think Karan Johar makes a movie so that he can go shopping. That's the basic. Dude, in the some of the songs, the sari changes every eight to ten seconds. It's like. It's just a shopping spree. I just want Hindi filmmakers to stop showing this. No one from uh because they keep showing these like uh, uh very well educated families in Bengal and all. No men dance usually in a no in no zamindari family and all. Two men start dancing and doing dhunuchi like Sanjay that did in that. What is that film? Parinita. Nobody does these things. Yeah, only Punjabis do. Only Punjabis do. We don't. Men Rata don't. Rata bini the ra ve bilu ni tera lal kagra. And another <laughs> thing is that Bengalis don't do it. There were two things. Oh, that thing is correct though. What they showed Nico that they are singing songs and reciting poetry and all. But uh, I would say go and watch the film. 
because you should know what Indian pop culture and high art is all about because this is what it's all about. In case you have any critique <laughs> feedback, you can mail us at podcasts at newslearn.com. I repeat podcasts at newslearn.com or you can just click on the link in the show notes below and send us what uh, you think of the show and what you want us to do. But uh, this is something that Rajshri had uh, recommended last uh, week. Give credit. And uh, she had said that if I don't cry in this film, I'm a heartless That bastard. I told you like every week. So about I didn't so cry for the record. You didn't even feel like crying? No. Nico? Uh, I think it is a very well made film but I had a serious ethical problem with it which I will and again it's difficult to review it because it is about someone who is dead in a very tragic and heroic incident spoilers for this so if you haven't watched a deepest breath and you don't there's one big spoiler coming up but that's that spoiler is at the heart of my biggest mm. criticism of the film okay. of an otherwise spectacular film but it is a very fundamental and philosophical disagreement what it's about is it's about free diving which is uh people hold their breath and you dive into the sea holding a rope you have to hold that rope and go down usually other than at that blue hole spot where they go underneath and it's as long as you can hold it they go down to as far as 110 meters which is fabulous 110 meters is how much Feet would be into three point three, so hundred oh. is three hundred thirty feet, so about three fifty odd feet. So in but a swimming the, pool, the, the the men's uh, record is I think one twenty four meters. Yeah. If you are a science student, <laughs> log off now because Rajshri is talking <laughs> complete. You can't go down because now suddenly because I'm of water. I'm fatter, no. <laughs> so that's why it's more difficult. Yeah, to Daniel, stick to the film instead of trying <laughs> to explain the science. My, See, if okay. you follow me on Twitter, <laughs> y'all will get physics inputs from me also. Okay, allow me. It's not me. correct what I'm saying. Okay, it's correct. Uh, free diving is an extreme sport where you dry uh, dive without any scuba equipment. Mm. What is scuba? Scuba gear. Self-contained underwater uh, breathing apparatus. There were many things which are uh, I found fascinating about this entire process. That even the safety divers, which I find a little odd, the safety divers don't use equipment themselves also. So they are down there without equipment, holding their bread, waiting to save you. So I, um, I try to figure out why the safety divers also don't. It's because, uh, you know, that uh, in in one of the sequences, that girl who the scuba diver says, "I saw them drowning, but I I couldn't do. I'm a scuba huh. diver because you can't ascend as fast as they oh, are that's because you why. have because if you ascend as fast, a you can't swim as fast as them because you have all this equipment." Yeah, yeah. And uh, if you ascend as fast as them, it'll... Um, oh, that, that rule bends. one thing that will, thing will happen. happen. So anyway, it's... Uh, you'll give the spoiler. I won't give that spoiler. But uh, it's about these two people. It's about free diving. It's what happens. And uh, the spoiler is that... So the spoiler will come in the audio only version. <laughs> and then I will tell you what my problem was with the film. But what are the things I liked? The rest of this podcast is available in the audio only version. Uh, we will on the 15th of August be uh, putting out Hafta and all our podcasts out of the paywall, even the ones that are paywall podcasts uh, because it's Independence Day and Independence Day is incomplete without independent media. And because it is Independence Day, we have a campaign from August 5, which is passed to August 20. So you can choose hampers. It's a 2200 rupee hamper, 5200 rupee hamper. Here they are. Uh, go to newsrun.com slash independence dash day dash offer or when you go to the website you can see what all there is and we have an NL Sena project that I told you about please do contribute the news media is going through such a shit show right now because of governments just making sure that no news should be of public service or public interest whether it is communal shit happening riots happening people spouting hate no we must say sub janga si. So there's a handful of news outfits who are trying to do journalism and they should not depend on advertising and definitely not government advertising. So do yourselves a favor and do the news ecosystem a favor. Subscribe and pay to keep news free and listen to the audio only version so I can give you the spoiler and my fundamental philosophical problem in an otherwise beautiful, stunning film called The Deepest Breath. Journalism at News Laundry is powered by the public because when the public pays, the public is served. Visit newslaundry.com slash subscription and pick a payment plan of your choice. Pay to keep news free and independent. Your future and indeed the future of democracy depends on it.